This is an independent review from a.applications.com. Today I'm going to be reviewing Run Sheldon. This is a free game in the iOS App Store. You're a tortoise running around from hares or a turtle running around from rabbits on this little course. It's kind of similar to um, Mario in a way actually. Um, maybe a cross between Mario and Sonic if you um, if I was to compare it to uh, more common games. You can see here it's got my best uh, my best mark which is 2092 meters so we can just tap to run which starts the game and basically the goal is to collect as many coins as you can and avoid the um, hares along the way the rabbits so you can land on them um, similar to how you can in Mario with uh, um, I'm, I'm not really sure what the creatures are in Mario but um, you can land on them. Here's a mushroom I can land on, and I jump higher when I land on that. Um, it kind of acts as a springboard. So I tap on the screen to jump, and the longer or harder I, longer I tap, the higher he will jump. Um, but there's still a limit to how high he'll jump. And I can avoid these and get to little power-ups. So there's a ton of different power-ups in this game. Um, some of them you can fly. Um, oops. So here I've died. It says don't give up. For 40 coins I can keep going. So as long as you collect enough coins you can keep going for quite a ways on this game actually. Which is pretty interesting. Um, but as I was saying there's quite a few power ups in this game that uh, the first time you go through you will collect a ton of power ups and it will give you a little description of what um, each one does as you collect it. And it does a very good job of explaining which what each one does and you'll figure out that, um, from trying it. So I'm going to keep, oops, I was too late. So it automatically quits if you don't press the button within a few seconds. But you can see I've just leveled up to level 2. I got uh, 2,500 coins and I can choose a reward. Or get my reward, sorry. So from here um, we can come back to this screen. want to go farther it says we can buy rewards um, upgrade your power-ups um, with various coins there's a little shop where you can buy various things but you you don't have to do that you can kind of just stay in um, and playing but I mean you might eventually want to start upgrading your stuff so let's see uh, boost your speed for seconds boost your speed for a second uh, attract nearby coins we can buy that one uh, coin magnet that seems pretty interesting and the coin doubler I guess we can only buy one. So we'll buy that one. And then we can go back and play and we'll attract nearby coins. So that's pretty uh, pretty interesting. It might help out quite a bit. But uh, again, this is called Run Sheldon. Some uh, definite uh, advantages, advantages to this game are that it's free. I mean, it's hard to beat a free game. Even if you only spend 15 minutes playing it, um, it was free and it kept you entertained. Um, it's pretty fun. It's it's a little difficult, or it can get difficult. Um, uh, the only downside I found so far is it is sometimes pretty hard to jump on a bunny. Uh, you can, but the jumping isn't completely um, predictable and accurate in this game. So maybe if uh, a bunny's running towards you and you try to jump, um, it's not always super easy to time it, so you will land on him. But um, That'll also get better as you get more experience with the game. So again, this is uh, Run Sheldon. It's a free game in the iOS App Store. Make sure to check it out. Thanks for watching.